Bye. I look like I have been hit by a bus. Hi guys. Um, it is early in the morning, which is why my hair is not brushed and I look like shit and all of that. Not that I don't look like shit a lot in my videos because that's my brand or whatever. But anyway, I wasn't gonna film today, but then I got this genius fucking video idea. <coughs> Let's talk about it. Here's what's going on. This morning, I had an idea. Why do I try to talk when I make coffee? Because the problem is that it's so loud that you can't hear me anyway. I have a lot of clothes in my closet and a lot of the clothes that I have in my closet have been in there for like five years. It takes a lot for me to like put something in the giveaway pile, mainly because I always tell myself, Emma, you could flip this, like you could crop it. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna take some of the things in my closet that I never wear and I'm gonna flip them and I'm gonna turn them into something I would wear, um, which means I might crop it, I might paint it, I might, who knows? I think it would be nice to do a little a little cute activity today. And this also will prevent me from shopping more because I have a serious shopping issue. <coughs> CamerlineCoffee.com. The first step is that we need to go into my closet and figure out what has potential, what hasn't been worn in a while, et cetera, et cetera. And then we can kind of go from there. I think this is gonna be especially useful with pants. For some reason, I have a lot of pants that are like, too long for me, and then I never wear them because they're too long. Okay, wait, also my closet is a mess. It's not good. Let's start with pants. Okay, the first thing I have that I might wanna do something to, do I wanna do something to these? No, I don't. Okay, first thing, I actually saw these yesterday in my closet. These are some green pants that are very cute, but they're way too long. These need to be cropped. If they were cropped, whole different pant, 50 times better, but also check this out. These pants are the same way. They're black pants, actually kind of a similar, no, they're not similar at all. Extremely long. These jeans I don't like. I ordered them and like, there was something about the button that I didn't like, but I feel like if I painted them or something, they could be better. Oh, okay, so these, I thrifted these, they're kids pants. The problem with them is that they're too, they fit super weird, um, but I feel like if I turn them into like maybe some sort of cargo short, they could be cool. Instead of wasting all of the room in my SD card, I'm going to find some shit and then I'll be back. It's been a few minutes. I found a bunch of shirts. I feel like I wanna do something bigger. So I think I'm gonna paint a pair of shoes because I have a lot of pairs of shoes that I just don't like these. So I got these yellow Air Forces and they're really cute, but for some reason like I, never wear them. Actually, I don't know if I wanna paint these. They're kind of amazing. But I do, I could paint these. So I think we're ready. Um, I think we're ready to get started. Let's get started. This video is basically just me cropping everything I own. The thing is, I'm too lazy to try everything on and like mark it. So I'm literally just gonna like eyeball it. This is not smart. Literally eyeballing it. This could go really bad. Okay, see, already this is so much cuter. Aww. Hopefully I didn't crop it too short. One down. Next we have this. Okay, this is funny because this is literally a, a workout top, but I feel like it could be cute if I crop it. I got this from Depop and I didn't realize it was a literal damn skin fucking running workout top. It also has a built-in bra, which I kind of want to cut out, but I don't know if that will ruin the whole entire... Hello? Ew, I literally ever since I was younger cannot stand anything built-in. Built-in underwear, built-in bra. I actually could cut it out. It just might take me like 45 minutes, so. You know what that means. I'm not gonna do it. The thing is too, there's this like hack when you're cropping stuff where if you put a hanger in it, so you like put it in a hanger and then you crop it, it like stays straighter. I don't wanna go get a hanger. If I knew how to sew, that's something I've always wished I was good at. I always, I've always wished that I was good at sewing. I'm like not in a mental state where I wanna learn things right now. I just kinda wanna already know how to do stuff. I would love to just be able to like go into the ocean and surf really well. Instead, I'm not that good at it. And so it's not fun to do it. That is definitely something to talk about with a the therapist for me. Cause something tells me that's not the way I'm supposed to be thinking about things. This top I've had for over a, like probably two years maybe. And I've been waiting to crop it and I just never had the energy to do it. But now here we are. Yeah, that's gonna be really short, huh? Okay. Well, it's too late now. I used to crop shit way too short, always. So I'd like go shopping, buy something, 
and then crop it too short and then I can never wear it. Like this is not gonna fit. I don't even wanna wait for the big reveal for this top. I wanna see it now and see how short it is. Okay, I actually did a good job. Can you see the blood in my pants? I um, have this severe issue with bleeding through Uh, tampons. People like say that it's gross. They're like, Ew, Emma, you're so gross because you bleed in your pants. And it's like, well, it's not my fault that I've had a period for two months. Oh my God, let me get into that. I mean, two weeks. I've been on my period for two weeks straight. I need to go to the doctor because there's something wrong with me, I think. I'm also really sad to cut this shirt because this shirt has such a cute, it says, Gumby goes for gold and it's so cute. I almost want to turn this bottom part into something. Like, should I turn it into a headband? Gumby goes for gold headband? No? Okay. This shirt is so incredibly boring, as well as being incredibly boring. You know, I have these fabric markers that I've never used. I feel like I could spice it up. Maybe like use black ink and like write something fun on it. Like something like, fuck everyone. Oh my God, today I was on Amazon and I was looking for like a graphic tee. Don't ask, there was a reason and I'm not gonna get into it. But there was a fucking shirt on Amazon that said yeet. Y E E T or be yeeted. Who writes this stuff? They're fucking genius. Okay, I also really like this yellow color and I kind of want to turn this into like a cute, like kind of rustic headband. Honestly, it's not terrible, but it's a little bit like, why don't I just order a pack of headbands off Amazon vibes? What do I put on it? I want to write something. Well, first I kind of want to test it. Oh my God, I'm a fucking genius. I'll test it on here. Like, how does the fabric marker look? Oh, terrible. It looks really bad. <laughs> Maybe I'll paint on it instead. I did bring my paint. What should I paint on here? What if I wrote TGIF on it? Like, thank God it's Friday. And then I could wear this shirt on Fridays. I like that. Brown could be kind of cute because I am very into brown. And then it's like pee pee poo poo check because it's like pee color and poopy color. Do you guys laugh at poop jokes? I do. Like I love poop and pee. I love potty humor. Like I, it's so funny to me. I'm kidding. Cut out the part that said that I was kidding because I'm not kidding. Is the universe trying to tell me not to use brown because this bitch is not opening for me? God, this is gonna splatter. Oh, God, it looks like I shoved this up my butthole. I'm gonna make it look kind of messy like and kind of homemade. My cats are being extremely loud. Mommy's putting TGIF on a shirt right now, honey. I've been really loving to say TGIF recently. Like I genuinely say this frequently, so it's kind of funny. Although it's like actually not funny. Like it's fucking off-white sold this, everybody would be like, ooh, or like Supreme or something. Everybody would lose their mind. You know the song um, by Katy Perry that's like, I think it's called TGIF or it's called Last Friday Night or something. There's a line in there that's like very inappropriate. And as a kid, I used to like sing it anyway because I didn't know what it meant, obviously. I remember one time I sang it in front of my dad and he was like, Emma, do you know what that means? And I was like, yeah. Anyway, I didn't. And I learned later what it meant and it was very sad and scary to me. And I was like, oh, why did I say that? It's crazy because when you see this shirt on my Instagram, don't act like you don't know the inside joke. Like now you're officially a part of the TGIF inside joke. TGIF. I mean, it's definitely not the best thing I've ever created, but I don't hate it. So that was good. Okay, painting check. It's the creativity for me. Okay, wait, let's actually talk about that trend. You know how everybody's like, it's the blank for me. Um, I hate that trend. It's the getting period stains in all your sweatpants for me. It's the old pair of Air Force Ones that you've been wearing for two years for me. Like that's what people would be saying to me. The truth of the matter is though for me is that when things are cropped, it's easier for me. Like what if I wore this with a turtleneck under it? That would be way cooler than me just wearing a like long, awkwardly length, like you know what I'm saying? This shirt might be not fixable. You know what my favorite time of, okay wait, here's the fun fact about me. My favorite part about Christmas when I'm cutting wrapping paper, and then I like just hit, I hit it just right. That sounded inappropriate. And it goes and it just like glides through the fucking wrapping paper and it's just like I don't know. This shirt, I don't actually hate it in its normal form, but I do think that I'd wear it more in it if it was cropped. If I wore low-waisted pants, like I could wear longer shirts, but the problem is that I'm only wearing high-waisted pants and then it gets all bunchy. Actually, this shirt's really cute, so I'm kind of bummed out that I'm cropping it, but I like, I know that it's like, it's the reason why I bought it. I bought it so that I could crop it and like, I don't think I'm gonna like it if I don't. So this is what we're doing, but if I regret it, it'll be a bummer. Honestly, I really thought that this shirt was gonna be a fail, but it wasn't, so that's a really good sign. Anyway, this is cute, although this might be too short. <gasps> cute! Now it's we're getting into dangerous territory, which is pants. Are the, ca the cats are literally banging on my door, like, 
Can you guys get a fucking job or something? First, we're trying these. These I'm really excited for because I really like these pants. They're really cool, amazing details. The only problem is that they just have the worst fit. I have these as a guide because I think the key, like when you're cutting, is to use a guide. Where did I put the sizzies? I'm just gonna send it. Oh, that, those are kind of dope. <gasps> and they ended up being the perfect length for the. Ah! Okay, that was a fucking serve. These might be like amazing. Ah! Also, if you remember these pants, you're you're a real one. I'm using them as the guide today. These look way better. Guys, I could have like a whole new wardrobe real quick. I'm excited to be able to wear these fucking pants. I don't know what it is, but whenever I buy, like I I think, well, I think I'm just short. Ugh. Yeah, these look way better too, yay! I hate when I look at my phone and no one texts me. Like I know that's something that everybody says. They're always like, oh, when you check your phone and you have no notifs. But it's fucking true, that shit bums me out. <laughs> so because these are black, I think it could be fun to do like cool doodles around like this front area and then like this back area, like, you know? I hope this marker works on these shoes. We'll find out right now, let's see. Oh, I don't think it works. <laughs> yeah, no, that shit doesn't work. Okay, what if I did cow print? That's kind of basic. Like, I feel like everybody does cow print. What I'm thinking is, what if I paint all of this brown? Okay, this isn't working either. Okay, I have an idea. So I have these other fabric markers that are white. I have no patience today. Do you wanna know why though? Because I've been on my fucking period for two weeks. I feel like shit. My body is not feeling good. I'm gonna draw with this white fabric pen on the black part. That could look cool. Hold on. Unfortunately, I don't really like what I did and I don't think I would wear these anymore like this than I would normally. Uh, actually, in fact, probably less. Oh my God, these look like they're fucking off-white shoes. Um, I don't like them. So if anybody wants these and is a size six and a half in women's, uh, let me know because I fucking don't like them at all. These are not, these are, I'm donating these. You know what, and so hopefully somebody else likes them. Like I really, I really think it's possible and they're gonna have one cool shoe and one, I mean, it's something different, but these are for me, I, this was the fail of the video. Uh, these shoes, I'm really angry at myself currently. Um, I will be looking up a way to remove fabric paint. Unfortunately, that's the whole point of fabric paint. It doesn't come out. Uh, but last but not least, we're gonna ruin this pair of pants. So let's fucking do that. First, I'm gonna color this button because this button is what bothers me the most. Oh, and of course, it doesn't stick. Okay, do you know what? No, Emma, don't give up. Oh my God, this is like, you guys are really seeing like a true breakdown right now. In the fabric market. I'm gonna style these clothes now and see if I how I did like did I Transform this shit in a good way. Did I even transform it at all? Is it better now? Is it worse now? Like that's what we're gonna find out Wow, so much better I like it I didn't like it before and I don't really like it now. So we were due for a little fail, which we did. We failed multiple times. We failed with the jeans. We failed with the Air Force Ones that are now damaged permanently. I mean, we definitely made our fuck ups today. We made our fair share. This is cute now. I actually love it. Fuck yeah. Like if Off-White sold this, if Supreme sold this, everybody would be like, now that's a cool shirt. Crazy story real quick before I put on the next outfit. The weirdest shit happened. I could not find this shirt for like 20 minutes. Those two doors have been closed this entire time I've been filming. I opened the door and this shirt is just sitting in my hallway outside of my door. My thing is, how the fuck did it get there? And do I have a poltergeist? I'm a little bit frightened by it, but alas. It's like a workout top that moms would wear. I like it. Okay. 
This is cute. Not too bad. Only three fails and the rest were actually pretty good. So anyway, this was my last one. So let's come to my bed. Whoa, here I am back in bed. Well, actually I didn't start this video in bed, but chamberlaincoffee.com. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for putting up with my two weeks of menstruation attitude. Menstruation means having a period for those of you who don't know. Yes, I have an attitude right now. Yes, I'm a little bit passive aggressive, but the fact that you guys are here for me at my highest and my lowest keeps me going. I wanted to be a little bit more creative and like draw on things and like, you know, like paint on things, but turns out we just got the scissors out and just slightly changed each piece. But this is a good thing, a good learning lesson because if you guys have a piece where you're like, eh, like I don't really, like I, you know, these pants are too long, but they fit everywhere else, blah, blah, blah. Just take out your scissors and cut them yourself. You know what I mean? <sighs> anyway, I love you all. Have an amazing day. Here's your little forehead kiss. Can't believe that's our thing now. And I love you all. Have the best day. Bye.